Get ready for your daily dose of marketing strategies and tactics from entrepreneurs with the guile and experience to help you find success in any marketing capacity. You're listening to Marketing School with your instructors, Neil Patel and Eric Sue. Welcome to another episode of Marketing School. I'm Eric Sue, and he's Neil Patel. And today we're going to talk about what Apple search ads are. So this one's actually pretty simple and straightforward. Basically, if you are searching through your iPhone and you open up your app store, and if you search for something, let's say you search for SEO, for example, you can actually bid on specific keywords where you want your app to show up. And then you're going to have a little sponsored app uh, at the top of it. And it's going to show that it's clearly sponsored. And then people can click through. Now, your objective here is to get, uh, you're aiming to get install. So you're really tracking your cost per install. You probably want to get more granular too down the road to see, you know, who's actually engaged. Uh, so cost per engage installs or things like that. But running Apple search ads, just search for Apple search ads through Google. And then, I mean, for us, we've been testing it for a little bit. And I will say the average cost per install or CPI uh, has been getting higher over the years. And we've been finding that running these Apple search ads, we're getting around anywhere from a 3 to $3.50 uh, CPI, which is not bad. Um, it's comparable to kind of the other platforms out there. But it's just good to have this ecosystem that's available to you to, you know, if you have an app right now, you're, you're trying to push it. Um, this is just another way to, to get in on it. Um, you have the options with Google. You have the options with Facebook as well. Um, and there's a host of other ones, but um, Apple coming into the game, that's definitely welcome. So, Neil, do you have any experience around this? Have you tried this? Yeah, I found it doesn't work too well unless your app already has decent ratings. If it's a brand new app, sure, you can use it to get a quick boost. But if you don't have decent ratings, the ads are just aren't as effective. And it's not just about the rating star, like are you a five star? It's If you have five stars and only five people rating, that sucks. If you had a five star and over 200 people rated it, now you're talking. Your ads are going to get way more clicks, way more installs. The cost is going to be way lower. So check it out. It's worth using. In the long run, I think the price is going to keep skyrocketing. and You're going to start paying like five, six bucks for really competitive industries. But overall, it's pretty effective. What I will say also, I mean, the, the app kind of the, the gold rush for apps, I think that certainly passed a couple of years ago where it's like, oh, if you make an app, you're just going to make billions of dollars. Instagram, case in point. So I, I think, you know, I think apps are, you know, for some of our clients right now, it's really supplemental to what they're doing. Uh, their main business is, you know, it's a, it's a web based business, right? Um, not so much around apps, but don't try to bet everything on, on apps if that's what you're trying to do. Um, it is really expensive right now. It's not as it's not like the early days where you can just, you know, get CPIs below a dollar and then just crush it that way. So um, there's not much more to add around this. I do recommend, you know, reading up a little more around it. It's not super sophisticated. We're talking like Facebook ads or Google AdWords. Um, so take a look at it. It might be worth a shot for your business and let us know how it goes. I mean, you know, tweet at us. Just tell us how your results were, and then maybe we'll mention it in, in as a case study in another episode. So that's it for today, and we will see you all tomorrow. This session of Marketing School has come to a close. Be sure to subscribe for more daily marketing strategies and tactics to help you find the success you've always dreamed of. And don't forget to rate and review so we can continue to bring you the best daily content possible. We'll see you in class tomorrow right here on Marketing School.